Rocky Ricardo Meade arrived at King's House on Thursday afternoon a brigadier with his three-year-old son, Rika, in his arms. It's a significant moment for the army man and his family. He's now the chief of defense staff. I, Rocky Ricardo Meade, do swear that I will be faithful. Formalities out of the way. Meade, now a major general, acknowledged that he now has a tremendous responsibility as the new army boss. Lao Tzu said the journey of a thousand miles begins with one step. The Prime Minister and the Governor General also declared that they had high expectation for the chief of the Jamaica Defense Force. Brigadier Meade, you now join a long line of distinguished military men who have led and managed one of our most valuable and highly respected institutions. I have confidence that the legacy of the JDF and its value and relevance to Jamaica will continue as new demands and new circumstances arise. This appointment, uh, Prime Minister, is particularly significant because of the challenges we face in Jamaica and the uncertainty we face in the region. And it again shows the confidence you have in me for asking me to take the reins at this challenging time. And the Major General says he is up to the task and safety in St. James is among his top priorities. For a long time we had to split a battalion to do several duties and so we're a bit underserved. So we're embarking on a recruiting uh, campaign now. We'll be recruiting uh, continuously, um, maybe 250 per quarter over the next year um, or two. So looking to have another thousand or more uh, servicemen in and so I can put a full battalion in the West to fully support the police. The former Army head, Major General Anthony Anderson, is now the National Security Advisor.